Wow, guys, um, we're going to mount a server and access the content. So, um, the first thing you do is just go to the settings. And of course, make sure the app is installed, which is the mounter app. So, from the settings, not the app section, but from the settings, click on the uh, drive mounter. Open, and you go Samba, SMB. Now I've already entered these in, so you can call it whatever you like, but I'm just going to call it box music. So you can just call it anything you like. So this will be the mount point. I'll show you that in a second. So, um, so for example, you start with say slash slash two backslashes and then you put the name of the server so which is on the network so um, if your server is John you put John and then you put another slash and then you put the name of the folder with the music the shared directory so if it's, got, if it's your music library you can just put that so uh, mine is uh, slash slash it's already popped up anyway. It's um, mine is A Alpha Victor UK slash my audio. So that's that's the name of the server. Or it could be a shared directory, it could be a PC elsewhere, it could be anything. So yeah, just put that. I haven't put a name or password for the uh, you know username password is just a food run network with all my with music on it for example so you click that and we enter that yeah don't need these two I'm just going to call it box music and then you press save give a few seconds and then it will just pop up right at the top when it's when it's done it will be under the storage option okay so you can scroll back to the player and we're going to go through the settings so right here and I'm just going to add Go right to the basic, right to the top here. You see, there's the basic settings. You find a player, click browser, and then it's going to be under storage, the default, default folder for the X100. So you look for storage here, yeah, expand it. I've got box music here, which we just created click that, close, so that will be here, so you can add as many folders as you like from different sources, so um, you click that, I just rescan, it just kind of saves all the settings and then refreshes the music, it's the same thing, you do the same when you um, change, make, make some changes to it, so rescan, make sure you apply the settings, we go back to the main player again which is here I'm just going to expand the albums you should actually get a lot more here because um, these are the ones on the um, server so we've just got a lot more over here and that's it so I can just play other albums on there I can add that here so just start playing anything. That should be there. Okay. And of course that will play. That's from the server. It'll play anywhere. Okay, so I'm gonna stop that. And of course it's the same um, analogy for viewing it through the 
your network so if you want to see the physical folders you just go through your network I also like to use the um, run option but I think I've already done that let's go here so that's that's the structure of the box over here just going to zoom in a bit So as you can see, my box is linked to my NAS or shared directory or whatever network device I'm using. So if I open that, you should see a lot of music on there and that as well. So a lot of stuff on there. Let's go back. Okay. loads of different stuff so, um, and that is what appears here and of course I just go back and see now one thing you need to be aware of when you're backing up make sure you dismount or your mount because if you don't it's going to back up the mounter as well so because it's um, set up in the main directory of the cocktail so you've got the main cocktail here and you've got the directories so this is how it works so you've got all your default structure folders here and you've got the mount option so if you're going to back up it's going to do the whole lot so just make sure you dismount this when you're done so to and don't delete it because then you're going to delete the lot from the other server as well. So um, just make sure you dismount. So when you're done, you can just go back and then um, you know, make sure it's not pointing to the uh, your network over here. Okay, so. Once it's done, or you can just disconnect it, and then it will be done. All right. Okay. So that's it. Thanks for watching.